Several Asian countries have space programs and are actively competing to achieve scientific and technological advancements in space, a situation sometimes referred to as the Asian space race in the popular media as a reference to the earlier space race between the United States and the Soviet Union. Like the previous space race, issues involved in the current push to space include national security, which has spurred many countries to send artificial satellites as well as humans into Earth orbit and beyond. A number of Asian countries are seen as contenders in the ongoing race to be the preeminent power in space. Topic: Asian space powers. Of the ten countries that have independently successfully launched a satellite into orbit, six are Asian, China, India, Iran, Israel, Japan and North Korea. China's first manned spacecraft entered orbit in October 2003, making China the first Asian nation to send a human into space. India expects to send astronauts to space in the Gaganyaan capsule by 2022, while the achievements of space programs run by the main Asian space players China, India, and Japan pale in comparison to the milestones set by the former Soviet Union and the United States. Some experts believe Asia may soon lead the world in space exploration. China has been the leader of Asia's space race since the beginning of the 21st century. The first Chinese manned spaceflight, in 2003, marked the beginning of a space race in the region. At the same time, the existence of a space race in Asia is still debated due to the non-concurrence of space milestone events like there was for the United States and the Soviet Union. Japan for example was the first power on Earth to get a sample return mission from an asteroid. There was however some concurrence between China and India to see which of those two could be the first to launch a probe to the Earth's moon back in the late 2000s decade. China, for example, denies that there is an Asian space race. In January 2007 China became the first Asian military space power to send an anti-satellite missile into orbit, to destroy an aging Chinese Feng Yun 1C weather satellite in polar orbit. The resulting explosion sent a wave of debris hurtling through space at more than 6 miles per second. A month later, Japan's space agency launched an experimental communications satellite designed to enable super high speed data transmission in remote areas. After successful achievement of geostationary technology, India's ISRO launched its first moon mission, Chandrayaan 1, in October 2008, which discovered ice water on the moon. India then launched on 5 November 2013 its maiden interplanetary mission, the Mars Orbiter Mission. The primary objective is to determine Mars' atmospheric composition and attempt to detect methane. The spacecraft completed its journey on 24 September 2014 when it entered its intended orbit around Mars, making India the first Asian country to successfully place a Mars orbiter and the only country in history to do so in the first attempt. ISRO became the fourth space agency in the world to send a spacecraft to Mars, only behind NASA, ROSCOSMOS, and ESA. In addition to increasing national pride, countries are commercially motivated to operate in space. Commercial satellites are launched for communications, weather forecasting, and atmospheric research. According to a report by the Space Frontier Foundation released in 2006, the space economy is estimated to be worth about $180 billion, with more than 60% of space-related economic activity coming from commercial goods and services. China and India propose the initiation of a commercial launch service. Topic. China China has a space program with an independent human spaceflight capability. It has developed a sizable family of successful Long March rockets. It has launched two lunar orbiters, Chang'e 1 and Chang'e 2. 
On 2 December 2013, China launched a modified Long March 3B rocket, with Chang'e 3 moon lander and its rover U-2 onboard toward the moon and successfully performed soft landing and rover operations, becoming the third country to do so. It also has plans to retrieve samples by late 2017. In 2011, China embarked on a program to establish a manned space station, starting with the launch of Tiangong-1 and followed by Tiangong-2 in 2016. China attempted to send a Mars orbiter in 2011 on a joint mission with Russia, which failed to leave Earth orbit. Nevertheless, the 2020 Chinese Mars mission with an orbiter, a lander and a rover has been approved by the government and is aiming a launch date in the year 2020. China has collaborative projects with Russia, ESA, and Brazil, and has launched commercial satellites for other countries. Some analysts suggest that the Chinese space program is linked to the nation's efforts at developing advanced military technology. China's advanced technology is the result of the integration of various related technological experiences. Early Chinese satellites, such as the FSW series, have undergone many atmospheric re entry tests. In the 1990s China had commercial launches, resulting in more launch experiences and a high success rate after the 1990s. China has aimed to undertake scientific development in fields like solar system exploration. China's Shenzhou 7 spacecraft successfully performed an EVA in September 2008. China's Shenzhou 9 spacecraft successfully performed a manned docking in June 2012. Furthermore, China's Chang'e 2 Explorer became the first object to reach Sun-Earth Lagrangian point in August 2011 and also the first probe to explore both Moon and asteroid by making a flyby of the asteroid 4179 Tutatis. China has launched Dampi, the most capable dark matter explorer to date in 2015, and world's first quantum communication satellite QUESS in 2016. Topic. India India's interest in space travel began in the early 1960s, when scientists launched a Nike Apache rocket from TERLS, Kerala. Under Vikram Sarabhai, the program focused on the practical uses of space in increasing the standard of living. Remote sensing and communications satellites were placed into orbit. The first Indian to travel in space was Rakesh Sharma, who flew aboard Soyuz T 11, launched April 2, 1984, from erstwhile USSR, just a few days after China said that it would send a human into orbit in the second half of 2003. Indian Prime Minister Adil Bihari Vajpayee publicly urged his country's scientists to work towards sending a man to the moon. It successfully sent its probe to the Moon in October 2008 and is planning its second Moon mission, Chandrayaan 2, for 2019. ISRO launched its Mars Orbiter mission on November 5, 2013, informally called Mangalyaan, which successfully entered into the orbit around Mars on 24 September 2014. India is the first in Asia and fourth in the world to perform a successful Mars mission. It is also the only one to do so on the first attempt and at a record low cost of $74 million. ISRO has demonstrated its re entry technology and till date has launched as many as 175 foreign satellites belonging to global customers from 20 countries, including US, Germany, France, Japan, Canada, UK. All of these have been launched successfully by PSLVs so far, gaining significant expertise in space technologies. In June 2016, India set a record by launching 20 satellites simultaneously. The PSLVs are also one of world's most reliable launch vehicles which clocked its 35th successful mission 39 total in a row as of February 2017, thus having success rate of nearly 90%. 
India broke the world record by successfully placing 104 satellites, almost tripling the Russian record of 37, in Earth orbit on the 15th of February 2017 on a single rocket launch, PSLV C37. Recent reports indicate that human spaceflight is planned with a spacecraft called Gaganyaan for December 2021 on a home-grown GSLV-3 rocket. Israel is also planning to send orbiters to Venus, Mars and Jupiter or comets and asteroids in the near future. Topic: <laughs> Japan. Japan has been cooperating with the United States on missile defense since 1999. North Korean nuclear and Chinese military programs represent a serious issue for Japan's foreign relations. Japan is working on military and civilian space technologies, developing missile defense systems, new generations of military spy satellites, and planning for manned stations on the moon. Japan started to construct spy satellites after North Korea test fired a Taipodong missile over Japan in 1998. The North Korean government claimed the missile was merely launching a satellite to space, and accused Japan of causing an arms race. The Japanese constitution adopted after World War II limits military activities to defensive operations. On May 2007 Prime Minister Shinzo Abe called for a bold review of the Japanese constitution to allow the country to take a larger role in global security and foster a revival of national pride. Japan has not yet developed its own manned spacecraft and does not have a program in place to develop one. The Japanese space shuttle Hope X, to be launched by the conventional space launcher H-2, was developed but the program was postponed and eventually cancelled. Then the simpler manned capsule Fuji was proposed but not adopted. Pioneer projects of single stage to orbit, reusable launch vehicle horizontal takeoff and landing ASSTS and vertical takeoff and landing Kanko Maru were developed but have not been adopted. A more conservative new JAXA manned spacecraft project is proposed to launch by 2025 as part of the Japanese plan to send manned missions to the Moon. Shinya Mitsura is doubtful about the Japanese manned moon project, and suspects the project is a euphemism for participation in the American Constellation program. JAXA planned to send a humanoid robot such as Asimo, to the moon. <laughs> Other minor players Topic. Iran Iran has developed its own satellite launch vehicle, named the Safir SLV, based on the Shahab series of IRBMs. On 2 February 2009, Iranian state television reported that Iran's first domestically made satellite Omid from the Persian Amid, meaning, hope had been successfully launched into low Earth orbit by a version of Iran's Safir rocket, the Safir-2. The launch coincided with the 30th anniversary of the Iranian Revolution. Iran is also developing a new launch vehicle Samorg rocket. <laughs> Israel Israel became the tenth country in the world to build its own satellite and launch it with its own launcher on 19 September 1988. Israel launched its first satellite, OFEQ-1, using an Israeli-built Shavit three-stage launch vehicle. The launching was the high point of a process that began in 1983 with the establishment of the Israel Space Agency under the aegis of the Ministry of Science. Space research by university-based scientists began in the 1960s, providing a ready-made pool of experts for Israel's foray into space. Since then, local universities, research institutes, and private industry, backed by the Israel Space Agency, have made progress in space technology. 
The agency's role is to support private and academic space projects, coordinate their efforts, initiate and develop international relations and projects, head integrative projects involving different bodies, and create public awareness for the importance of space development. Topic. North Korea North Korea has many years of experience with rocket technology, which it has passed along to Pakistan and other countries. On December 12, 2012, North Korea placed its first satellite in orbit with the launch of Kwangmyongsong-3 Unit 2. On 12 March 2009 North Korea signed the Outer Space Treaty and the Registration Convention, after a previous declaration of preparations for the launch of KWANGMYONGSONG-2. North Korea twice announced satellite launches, Kwangmyongsong-1 on 31 August 1998 and Kwangmyongsong-2 on 5 April 2009. Neither of these claims were confirmed by the rest of the world, but the United States and South Korea believe there were tests of military ballistic missiles. The North Korean Space Agency is the Korean Committee of Space Technology, which operates the Musudan Ri and Tongcheng Dong Space Launch Center rocket launching sites and has developed the BAEKD USAN 1 and UNYA BAEKD USAN 2 space launchers and Kwangmyongsong satellites. In 2009 North Korea announced several future space projects, including manned space flights and the development of a manned partially reusable launch vehicle. The successor to the Korean Committee of Space Technology, National Aerospace Development Administration NADA, successfully launched an Unya-3 launch vehicle in February of 2016, placing the Kwangmyongsong-4 satellite in orbit. Topic. South Korea South Korea is a newer player in the Asian space race. In August 2006 South Korea launched its first military communications satellite, the MUGUNGHWA-5. The satellite was placed in geosynchronous orbit and collects surveillance information about North Korea. The South Korean government is spending hundreds of millions of dollars in space technology and was due to launch its first space launcher, the Korea Space Launch Vehicle, in 2008. South Korea's government justifies the cost for reasons of long-term commercial benefits and national pride. South Korea has long seen North Korea's significantly longer missile range as a serious threat to its national security. With the nation's first astronaut launched into space, Lee Se yin South Korea gained confidence in entering the Asian space race. They have completed the construction of Naro Space Center. South Korea is now attempting to build satellites and rockets with local technology. South Korea is pursuing a space program that could defend the peninsula while lessening their dependency on the United States. Topic. Pakistan Pakistan started pursuing space technology on 16 September 1961, when Pakistan's space agency, SUPARCO was created, with renowned physicist Abdus Salam as its first administrator. In its early days, SUPARCO researched on the development of solid fuel sounding rockets with assistance provided by the United States. On 7 June 1962, with the launch of the Rebar I lit. Teller of the Way rocket, Pakistan became the tenth country in the world to successfully conduct the launch of an unmanned spacecraft. This rocket had been developed by a team of scientists and engineers of the Pakistan Air Force, led by Air Commodore Brigadier General Wladyslaw Yosef Marian Tarovich in collaboration with NASA and was launched from Sanmiani, Pakistan's first space launch facility. SUPARCO's unmanned space program continued till 1972, with nearly 20 successful launches. 
SUPARCO's unmanned space program suffered setbacks during the 1970s and the 1980s, delaying the development and launch of Pakistan's first satellite, Badr I till 1990 when it was launched from China. SUPARCO launched Pakistan's second satellite, Badr B in 2001 from Baikonur Cosmodrome using a Ukrainian Zenit-2 rocket, followed by Poxit-1R in 2011 which was contracted and actually built and launched by China, was Pakistan's first communication satellite. On 9 July 2018, Pakistan launched two satellites from China's Jiaquan Satellite Launch Center with Long March 2C rocket. The Pakistan Remote Sensing Satellite PRSS-1 was a dual-purpose Earth observational and optical satellite. It was designed and developed by SUPARCO's engineers. It was 1,200 kg 2, weight satellite which will operate at an altitude of 640 km 400 miles. With the launching of PRSS-1, Pakistan has become one of the few countries to have its own remote sensing satellite in the orbit. Another flagship satellite, Pakistan Technology Evaluation Satellite PAX-1A, which was also designed and developed by SUPARCO's engineers, has also co-launched with PRSS-1 by the same launch rocket, Long March 2C. It was a 285 kilograms, 628 pounds weight satellite with an optical payload commensurate with national needs. It will operate at an altitude of 610 kilometers, 380 miles. Pakistan intends to send its first national in space on board a Chinese spacecraft by 2022, as announced by Information Minister Chaudhry. Bangladesh With the planned launch of Bangabandhu-1 satellite purchased abroad, Bangladesh will operate its first communication satellite. Bangladesh Space Agency intends to launch satellites after 2020. Bangladesh's government has stressed that the country seeks an «entirely peaceful and commercial» role in space. Other nations and regions Indonesia operates their own communication satellites purchased abroad, and intends to develop and use their own small space launch vehicle Pengorbatan RPS 420. .Other space players are Malaysia and Turkey, that announced multi-task space programs in 2006 and 2007. They intend to develop their own satellites and launchers in the near future, and man space facilities. As of 2012 Turkey was developing its own military satellite. The first Gokturk satellite is planned to be launched in 2013. The Turkish satellite is planned to be capable of taking satellite images of greater than 2 meters per pixel resolution, thus making Turkey the second nation in the world capable of such a feat, after the United States. Topic. Timeline of national firsts Also see the section, Comparison of key technologies Topic. Other achievements First Asian country to collaborate on the International Space Station, Japan Topic comparison of key technologies Records of each country are listed by chronological order unless otherwise noted. First independent launches Rocket, Satellite, Japan 1970 Lambda 4S, Osumi China 1970 Long March 1st, Dong Fang Hong I India 1980 SLV, Rohini D1 Israel 1988 Shabbat, OFEQ1 Iran 2009 Safir 1, Omid North Korea 2012 Unya 3, minus 3 Unit 2 Payloads in Orbit by Number Active, Total, First 5 as of 2017 China 200 
103 321st Japan 81 216 India 51 90th First Indigenous Low Earth Orbit Manned Spaceflights China 2003 Shenzhou, Shiguang cancelled India tilde 2021 Gaganyan planned Independent Human Spaceflights Total Persons – Person Flights China 10 12th First Independent Extravehicular Activity China 2008 Shenzhou 7 First Independent Unmanned – Manned Space Rendezvous China 2011 2012 Shenzhou 8 and Tiangong 1, Shenzhou 9 and Tiangong 1 multi satellite simultaneous launches by number India 104 satellites PSLV C 37 February 2017 China 20 satellites Long March 6 September 2015 Japan 8 satellites HIIA F 15 2009 First flight of space shuttles including shuttle shaped hypersonic re entry vehicles reached to space Space. Japan 1996 Hyflex under Hope X program cancelled. China 2001 Shenlong Project 921 to 3 cancelled. India 2016 Hypersonic Flight Experiment under the RLV Technology Demonstration Program tilde 2025 Avatar RLV Program under development. First Space Habitation Module Japan 2008 Kibo China 2011 Tiangong 1 First Space Laboratory Japan 2009 Kibo China 2016 Tiangong 2 First Orbiters to the Moon Japan 1990 Hitten, Hagoromo, 2007 Selene China 2007 Chang'e 1, 2010 Chang'e 2, 2014 Chang'e 5 T1 India 2008 Chandrayaan 1 First intentional moon landings Japan 1993 Hitten Controlled impact at end of its mission India 2008 MIP Moon impactor China 2009 Chang'e 1 Controlled impact at end of its mission First lunar soft landings Lunar rovers China 2013 Chang'e 3 U2 India 2019 Chandrayaan 2 Planned Orbiters to Mars India 2013 Mangalyaan 2020-23 MA Gangalyan 2 planned China 2011 YINGHU01 failed 2020 Mars Global Remote Sensing Orbiter and Small Rover planned Japan 1998 Nozomi failed 2020 Mars Terahertz Microsatellite planned Intentional Mars Landing China 2020 Mars Global Remote Sensing Orbiter and Small Rover planned Orbiter to Venus Japan 2010 Akatsuki India 2023 SHUKRA YAAN-1 planned asteroid explorations Japan 2003 sample return Hayabusa 2014 sample return Hayabusa 2 2014 flyby Procyon failed China 2012 flyby Chang'e 2 capability of launch vehicle inactive payload to Leo China CZ5 Leo 25T 2016 active Japan HIIB Leo 16.5T 2009 active India G SLVMK3 Leo 10T 2017 active Iran Safir 1B Leo 50 kilograms 2008 active North Korea Unya 3 200 kilograms 2009 active capability of launch vehicle inactive payload to GTO China CZ514T 2016 active Japan HIIB8T 2009 active India GSLVMK34T 2017 active Active. Cryogenic rocket engine China, YF-73 1987-2000, YF-75 1994-present, YF-77 in development India, CE-7.5 2012-present, CE-20 2017-present, Japan, LA-5 1986-present, LA-7 1994-present, solid fuel rocket India, S-200, burn time 130s, ISP, VAC, 274.5 s thrust back 5150 kilonewtons Japan SRBA burn time 100s ISP back 280s thrust back 2260 kilonewtons Israel Shavit's first stage burn time 82s ISP back 280s thrust back 1650.2 kilonewtons China, Kuaizhou China, Long March 11th Optical Satellite Imagery by Highest Available Resolution Japan 2013 IGS Optical 5 volts 0.4 m Israel 2010 OFEQ 9-0.5 m 
China civil use 2015 GF9 0.5 meter India 2016 Cardosat 2 E 0.6 meters South Korea 2012 KOMPSAT 3 0.7 meter Iran 2011 RASAD 1 150 meters radar satellite imagery by resolution Japan 2013 IGS radar 4 less than 1 meter China civil use 2015 YG 29 0.5 meter Israel 2008 Texer 1 to 1 meter India 2012 RISAT 1 to 1 meter South Korea 2013 CompSat 5 to 1 meter communications satellite technology China 2011 NIGCOMSAT 1R 5150 kg 28 transponders solar array provide a power of 10.5 kilowatts Japan 2011 Street 2 5090 kg 51 transporters India 2014 GSAT 16 with 48 transponders 2018 GSAT 11 5854 kg 40 transponders solar array provide a power of 13.6 kilowatts resupply spacecraft launch payload Japan 2009 HTV 6000 kg China 2017 Tianzhou approximately 6500 kilograms solar sail spacecraft Japan 2010 Ikara spacecraft powered by indigenous plasma thrusters power thrust specific impulse Japan 1981 ETSIV unnamed engine 20W Minnesota 300S Teflon pulsed plasma thruster China 1981 Dongfeng 5 ballistic rocket MDT-2A, 5W, Minnesota, 280S Teflon pulsed plasma thruster Japan 1995 Space Flyer Unit Apex, 430W, 12.9 mN, 600S Magnetoplasmodynamic Thruster Spacecraft powered by indigenous ion thrusters Power, Thrust, Specific Impulse Japan 2003 Hayabusa Mu-10, 350W, 8 mN, 3200S Microwave Ion Thruster China 2012 Shijian 9A Lips 200 1 kilowatt 40 millinewtons 3000 s ring cusp magnetic field ion thruster India 2017 GSAT 9 spacecraft powered by indigenous hull thrusters power thrust specific impulse South Korea 2013 DUBAISAT 2 0.3 kilowatts 7 millinewtons 1000 s China 2016 Shijian 17 HEP 100MF 1.4 kilowatts Minnesota 1850S magnetic focusing hull thruster China 2016 Shijian 17 LHT 100 1 35 kilowatts 80 millinewtons 1600S date as assumed only projects with under development or above status have been listed Topic. Orbital launch frequency Topic. 2001 to 2010 Topic. 2011 to 2018 Topic. Solar system exploration Solar system exploration and manned spaceflights are major space technologies in the public eye. Since Sakigaki, the first interplanetary probe in Asia, was launched in 1985, Japan has completed the most planetary exploration, but other nations are catching up. Topic. Moon race The Moon is thought to be rich in helium-3, which could one day be used in nuclear fusion power plants to fuel future energy demands in Asia. All three main Asian space powers plan to send men to the Moon in the distant future and have already sent lunar probes. Topic. 
Topic: <laughs> Probing the Moon. Japan was the first Asian country to launch a lunar probe. The Hitan Japanese Flying Angel spacecraft known before the launch as Muses A, built by the Institute of Space and Astronautical Science of Japan, was launched on 24 January 1990. In many ways, the mission did not go as was planned. Kagaya, the second Japanese lunar orbiter spacecraft, was launched on 14 September 2007. China launched its first lunar probe, Chang'e-1, on 24 October 2007 and successfully entered lunar orbit on 5 November 2007. India launched its first lunar probe, Chandrayaan-1, on of October 2008 and successfully entered its final lunar orbit on 2 November 2008. The mission was considered a major success and the probe detected water on the lunar surface. Topic: <inaudible> Moon landings. The first confirmed moon landing from Asia was Hitton's mission in 1993. An intentional hard landing at the end of the mission. Some pictures of the lunar surface were taken before impact. Hidden was not designed as a moon lander and had few scientific instruments for lunar exploration. The next Japanese moon landing program was the Lunar A, developed from 1992. Although the Lunar A orbiter was cancelled, its penetrators are integrated into the Russian Luna Glob program, which was scheduled to launch in 2011. The penetrators are relatively hard landers, but they are not expected to be destroyed at impact. The first Asian probe that was part of a lunar landing program was the Indian Moon Impact Probe MIP, released from Chandrayaan-1 in 2008. MIP was a hard lander and was designed to move the ground under for research purposes. MIP was designed to be destroyed at impact. Its instruments performed lunar observations to within 25 minutes before impact. The landing test will be applied to future soft landings such as Chandrayaan-2, planned for 2019. The Chinese Chang'e-1 spacecraft also achieved a systematic hard landing at the end of its mission in 2009, when China became the sixth country to reach the lunar surface. One purpose of the lander was to pre-test for future soft landings. A Chinese lunar soft lander is achieved with the Chang'e-3 mission. Topic: <laughs> Exploration of the major planets. Japanese interplanetary probes have been mostly limited to small solar system bodies such as comets and asteroids. JAXA's Nozomi probe was launched in 1998, but contact was lost with the probe due to electrical failures before visiting the planet Mars. The second Japanese probe for the planet Venus, Akatsuki, was launched in 2010. Akatsuki entered orbit around Venus on December 7, 2015. Chinese scientists expect that China will take 20 years to launch independent planetary probes. The Chinese manned Mars exploration program is planned for around 2050 by the Chinese Academy of Sciences. India has successfully launched Mars Orbiter mission on November 5, 2013. It reached Mars on September 2014. India has become the only country to successfully insert a satellite into Martian orbit in its maiden attempt. It also became the first Asian country to achieve this feat. Topic. Asian space agencies and programs Bangladesh – Space Research and Remote Sensing Organization People's Republic of China – China National Space Administration Chinese Space Program India – Indian Space Research Organization Indonesia – National Institute of Aeronautics and Space Lepan. Iran – Iranian Space Agency ESA. 
Israel, Israeli Space Agency ESA. Japan, Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency JAXA. Malaysia, Malaysian National Space Agency MNSA. North Korea, National Aerospace Development Administration NADA. Pakistan, Pakistan Space and Upper Atmosphere Research Commission SUPARCO. Philippines – National Space Development Program NSDP, Philippine Space Program South Korea – Korea Aerospace Research Institute Kerry. Republic of China – National Space Organization NSPO. Thailand – Geoinformatics and Space Technology Development Agency GISTDA. Sri Lanka SupremeSat Topic. See also Space race Topic. Notes and references Topic External links Japan's Evolving Space Program, Comparison of Japan's Program with the Rest of Asia September 2011 Asian Space Race Accelerates, Comparison of Indian, Chinese and Japanese Space Programs in Different Aspects November 2013